In my life, like in my art, I seek out experiences filled with mysterious possibility. I'm endlessly inspired by the fine balance between what is dissonant and what is harmonious. I want this to be how I live every day. I want this to be what's around me all the time. It's nice. The Delirium Constructions is the current title for my ongoing photographic series of fabricated narratives in which I bring together dissociated characters or themes into close proximity and intimate interaction. You don't have to make out. All right. <laughs> I should believe. <really. laughs> While most of these scenarios are staged, the emotions that result, the uneasiness, or the curiosity or the sensuality are spontaneously captured through improvisation and direction and authentically experienced. Yeah, this is good. <laughs> I want to photograph the raw emotional underbelly of scenes that I find and scenes that I fabricate. I've also brought the delirium constructions to life through recent experiments with performance and tableau vivant. For this project, I collected 35 models with distinctive visual personalities and in various stages of undress and assembled them on platforms in an array of interactive narratives as a living, breathing image. This was the centerpiece to a party I threw in Brooklyn last spring. Social boundaries between the private and the public, and between the erotic and the desexualized, were suspended to capture the subject's contextual experience. Another medium I use to explore some of these same themes is Polaroid. I've been taking one self-portrait each day for 12 years now. I plan to pursue this project for life. I've also explored this relationship between dissonance and harmony in my vocal arrangements of Bulgarian folk songs with my quartet, Black Sea Hotel. It's funny to me because this haunting song is really just about a guy looking for shoes. Sometimes I model for my models. I will always take risks for my models, just as they do for me. It's also so important for me to build trusting and enjoyable friendships with the people I photograph. And of course, the art force behind it all is my still photography. Beautiful. Sexy, sultry. Great. Oh, we're like, Touch exactly each other, have sex. Let's have you just straight back against the back wall. <laughs> come in, come in. Wow, you look cool up there. Will you hold that light again? I feel like a broken record. <laughs> It's an openness to experimentation and improvisation in life and in art without judgment that keep me energized and surprised and always asking new questions.